What's up guys, I'm Random Frank P. Today I'm gonna show you some tips and tricks on how to greatly improve your cable management for your setup. Now behind me, as you can see, I have a ton of things here, very great, cheap and inexpensive accessories that you can pick up to really improve your cable management. Now as the host of Room Tour Project, I see a ton of submissions, a ton of setups, and a lot of times cable management will make or break your setup. It's the kind of thing where if your cable management is great, no one's going to notice and that's good, no one's going to comment on it, but if it's bad, it's going to really break your setup, everyone's going to notice it, and it just takes away from your overall setup experience. But um, these things are really going to help you out, so I'm going to show you each one in detail on how they can help you improve your cable management, and like I said, everything will be in the description down below so you can check them out. But yeah, let's start it off. First up are cable management boxes from a company called Quality Choices. Essentially, there are boxes that hide your cables, power bricks, extension cords, etc. without people seeing the mess. The package I have came with two different sized boxes, as well as additional accessories which I'll get into in a little bit. The larger box is 16 inches long, and the smaller one is 9 inches, so both are definitely going to provide enough space to hide your cables. Inside you can throw your power extension cords, and it'll all be nicely tucked away and hidden from being exposed, and there's a ton of space inside so you can fit multiple inside if need be. The cables also will channel out the side of the box. It's pretty self-explanatory how to use these, really. They're just a great way to hide the clutter without having to worry about being neat or organized. You can put these under your desk on the ground out of sight, and to prevent scratching the surface they're on, there are two padded feet on the bottom in case you have it on top of your desk, for example like I have here behind a monitor or something. For around $30, these boxes will hide the cable mess and give you an easy get out of jail free card for your management. Now let's get into the rest of the cable management accessories, and there's a lot of them. We've got desktop cable holders, zip tie mounts, zip ties, the normal ones and reusable ones, some velcro strip options, double sided tape, and something called gear ties. Now let's get it on. So these multi-purpose cable clips, you've probably seen them before because they're pretty popular and they're a very affordable solution. Now I do have two packs of six and these did come with those two containers that I showed you before, so it's definitely a nice addition to have. There's these little rubber organizers that pretty much hold your cables in place for you and on the bottom there is this removable sticky tape which you can use to mount on the side of surfaces like desks or even underneath which is what I use them for. Just for an example, on the side of my desk, I have my iPhone cord and my microphone cord, so you can just have them there neatly organized. Um, you can pull them up and down if you want, so they're going to stay there. They're just really out of the way, um, not really taking up much room. But on the bottom, like you see here, I do have them for holding some of the things that I have mounted. Keeping the cables up and organized is much better than having them drooping down underneath my desk. You can get them pretty cheap in packs for around $10. Next up is rather obvious, you should know about zip ties for cable management, but were you aware about the reusable zip ties, which are probably one of my most favorite accessories when it comes to cable management? Now I probably don't have to show you, but zip ties, you know, they're just a really great and inexpensive way to hold a bunch of cables tightly together without them separating. But what I use them for primarily is with these little mounting brackets that I put on the bottom of my desk to keep a bunch of the cables again out of the way from drooping down and interfering and being an eyesore. These you just mount them to the bottom, they stick up, and you can use the zip ties to keep everything organized. Since my desk is motorized, there's a lot of cables that ordinarily wouldn't be there so these two just help keep them up and out of the way which is always great for a pack of a hundred of these self-adhesive tie mounts you can get them for only around ten dollars and now for the more interesting accessory are these removable zip ties you can reuse these because they pretty much work exactly the way that ordinary zip ties do you now you still can fit it through the loop uh, so has a very powerful and strong um, hold on the cables but it has this little clip which you press down and it releases it so you can use these over and over again instead of having to throw them out um, it's a very long and wide cable so you could still fit a bunch of cables inside if you please and you will definitely find these underneath my desk holding my monitor and PC cables because they're just is definitely a great solution for around five dollars you get a pack of 50 of these now let's talk about these gear ties I actually found these in a camping store and thought they'd be a pretty cool thing to include because of their multi-purpose use um, I have a pack of four of them they're three inches long I also have a two pack of 12 inch long gear ties 
and they're pretty much just these rubber uh, twist ties that are reusable. You can twist them, a bunch of different orientations, very flexible, and honestly, you can use these for a bunch of things, and they're deceivingly strong. Even the little three inch ones holds a bunch of cables very tightly without them breaking loose or anything like that. And here, like I said, I have the 12 inch ones. You can use these for holding multiple cables at once, and uh, or maybe even the back of your PC, keeping them nice and organized behind there with just one large zip tie. I don't know, I thought they were cool. They come in a bunch of different sizes and colors, and you get the packs pretty cheap for around like two to three bucks. And these hook and loops, these Velcro ties were the second additional accessory that came with those two boxes in the front. And you know Velcro, these can be used again for holding a bunch of different cables together. Again, pretty self-explanatory, but the hook and loops obviously reusable and uh, they're not that bad of a deal. However, what I use primarily and what I picked up for pretty cheap again are these giant Velcro strips that I got from Amazon. Um, they come in these two giant rolls. And the reason I like to use these primarily is because while they're like an ordinary uh, Velcro strip that you'd find. They are kind of more secure because I had this little loop in the front which you can pull the Velcro strip through for some extra security so you know that your cables aren't going to budge and that the Velcro strip won't come undone accidentally. So I like to use these even with a little glue gun to have them mounted underneath my desk and it's been working great for me. The Velcro is pretty strong and I would definitely recommend them. Again, a bunch of different multi-uses for these so why not? Uh, the pack that I got for around 10 bucks is a pretty great price. And this double-sided scotch tape, um, I get comments on this all the time because I use this to mount things underneath my desk. Obviously, as the title says, it is double-sided tape, so there's sticky sides on both ends of the tape. And I use it to mount my, uh, my USB hub, my amp and DAC underneath my desk so I don't have to have it on top of my desk. Frees up a lot of space, and I just have the cables underneath. Uh, I think it looks a lot better. And the tape is pretty strong. You can get a bunch of different ones, different lengths, widths, and uh, weight supports. This one was around like $3. I highly recommend using this double-sided tape. A great thing to keep things out of the way. All right, guys, it's gonna wrap it up, and I hope this video helped you out on your very painful journey to improving your cable management. I know it's not the most fun thing, but like I said, it can make or break your setup. And once everything's very neatly organized and tucked away with all these accessories, I think you're gonna feel a lot better about your setup as a whole. So I really hope this helped you out. You can always hit me up and follow me on Twitter, at RandomFrankP, very active on Twitter, so if you wanna hit me up on there. And last, if you haven't already, if you like this video, you like gaming setup stuff, tech videos, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I've done a ton of tech videos in the past. You're not gonna to wanna to miss out on some really awesome stuff I got coming in the near future. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm Random Frank P. Have a good day.